Ryan Callahan, Dr. File Finder, and welcome to part four of our special Butterscotch.com 10 part series on reinstalling Windows XP. Now, at the end of part three, we had reached this screen where it's asking us about reformatting. And you absolutely want to reformat that freshens up your hard drive. Now, the one option is leave the current file system intact. We don't want to do that. Then it's talking about formatting the petition using the FAT file system or the NTFS file system doing it either the regular way or the quick way. Now for your reference, there's information on the FAT file system, which stands for File Allocation Table, here on Wikipedia. I'll put the links in the show notes. FAT is a relatively straightforward system. NTFS is the recommended system. It has several advantages over FAT. So I personally would recommend using NTFS. And I would also recommend that you do the full format. Now for the purposes of this tutorial, I'm going to use the quick format simply because of time constraints. So my recommendation is to use NTFS file system and do the full format of the partition that way you're sure that everything is freshly formatted. So with that decided, we press enter. And now it's reminding us that we're going to format this partition. To format, press F. So I press F and it's starting to format. It's gonna format fairly quickly because it's a relatively small drive. So our format's done. And now we're moving on to get ready to do the setup. And Windows is copying files. So we'll leave that there, working on that. And we'll return in the next segment to continue our reinstall. And that concludes part four.